St. Somebody's Episcopal <laughs> Church. I don't know. Uh, hi, camera. Hi. <laughs> you see the skull and crossbones there? This is not a pirate's grave. This is a 33-year-old man who died of a contagious disease. And it is marked so by the skull and crossbones, which is an indication of what? Poison or of death. Because you see, people who died of contagious diseases, we didn't have antibiotics back then. So people thought that even their dead bodies, even their dead bodies, that horrible disease was in the ground. House where an elderly woman lurks in the hallways. I see her quite often. Why all this energy in one place coming from this large cross? So I had to know a little something about this cross so I could give you the true, true of it. So the gentleman his name on this side, his wife's name on the other side, his first name Andrew, her first name Julia. And I was thinking, what is, what is so important about this cross? Why so much energy? And then, to my amazement, as I am walking around the cross, I didn't notice the baby cross. But I tripped on it, and I almost fell and busted my knee. And all this energy has everything to do with the large cross for you. What do you think? It's fine. You having fun? It's scary. Scary. You scared? You've jumped a whole lot. Yeah, I have. Everybody had a good time? Yeah. All right, let's hear it. Favorites. Patrick, what about your favorite? Everything. Everything? Yeah. Peyton, favorite? I really like the history. I like the word she spoke. She really told a story while she spoke. Yes. And she really, really jazzed it up, didn't she? Yes, she did. She, she did. Mama, what was your favorite? I didn't even know that. That the rocks were yeah. ballast from the ships that they removed when they docked. Who knew that, right? And she, um, she told her children to bury her own Oh, we didn't even see that yeah. one, did we? We might see it tomorrow. And I really like going in that hotel. And learning about the history of that neat restaurant. Hoogan's Porch. Yep. Yeah, Astro. Yeah, just seeing favorite. the church is lit up at night. It was you know, my favorite was learning about the four corners here because it's city law, federal law, state law, and then the law of God all on four corners of the all on four corners of this of these two roads. I think that I thought that was really cool. Uh, I really did enjoy learning about uh, the history. Um, I just thought it was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed that. Something that none of us have ever done before, right? Right. New experience. What was that? It was my phone. It was not your phone. Yes, it was. He has, oh! he has a pooting hat. <laughs> that was awful. Do it again. Okay, so every time we come to Charleston, we eat at the Crab House, which is uh, on the Wapu Cut. But they also have a location downtown near the city market. And so we were down here for the city market, and we thought, ah, let's eat at the Crab House, because we always eat at the Crab House. We're just eating at a different location. <laughs> He's actually me Hello there. Okay. 
this is what Patrick was doing. That's kind of what Patrick looked like doing it too. You're not being coordinated. <laughs> Yeah, we're in a really nice restaurant, um, and our kids have the best manners, and we just wanted to document how well they listen and behave in public. You do realize well, bad manners are food yeah. the table. The only, the only thing Peyton did was cross her leg, and she bumped the table. That's the only and thing. And more shades, but we are outside, but, so yes. that's acceptable. But notice he's not even sitting. <laughs> he's right. And he's been up and down, up and down, and playing the, playing the drums on the table. And Thank you, sir. Tried to steal French fries off my plate during the prayer. He's now dropping his straw. <laughs> now I know you're not putting it on YouTube. Oh, I will. <laughs> okay, Pastor Kevin. You do realize you're talking about bad manners. It's bad manners to have your phone out at the table. <laughs> I'm just documenting this for posterity. <laughs> Well, to finish up, this is a view of the rooftop dining at the Crab House in downtown Charleston. And hope that you've enjoyed watching this.